Hey guys, and welcome back to a Resident Evil Nemesis. When we last left off, we had recovered the vaccine, and now we just need to get back to Jill. And, uh, you know, make her feel a little bit better. Give her a nice old uh, injection. Yes, I think she'll like that. Anyway, let's go. Hello, it seems to be a time-based bomb. Yes, Carlos. Yes, it is. I wonder how that got there. Anywho, I think we better get a wheel on before this thing actually goes uh, off. Damn you, Nikolai! Come on. That's some pretty impressive C4. Hmm, okay game, whatever you say game. Right, anyway, let's continue. Let's go back to the clock tower, see how our partner in crime is doing. Ooh. Oh, someone's being a heavy-footed uh, gentleman over there. Oh, hello ladies. See the ladies of the house are in. Alright, well, no time to play with them, unfortunately. Just a waste of ammo. Ah, uh, we got spiders. Oh, we got spiders. Ah, uh, how? Okay, we didn't actually get poisoned there. And little sneaky spider was waiting for us, wasn't he? He was all ready. Ready to bite. Well, that's not fair. Alright, mister, with your loud ass boots, calm down. We're on our way. Jeez. Well, definitely did a number on this place, didn't they? Jeez, okay. Well, this ain't good. Ooh! Dude! Did you get uglier? Is that possible? How did you get uglier, sir? Well, we're gonna give you a bit of a run around the houses. Yep. He's had enough. You know, I've tried a few times to actually take him out here. You can't. Sadly. Nothing you can do. You know. After he's taken X amount of damage, he just kind of gives up. And... Starts uh, making his way towards the door. Thanks, dude. You fell for the oldest trick in the book. The old uh, place swapper. Literally pulled me closer to the door. Oof. I guess, uh, I guess you didn't get any smarter. Bye, dude. Yeah, uh, you can't take him out here, sadly. Carlos lacks the power to bring him down. Um, all right, well, you know, I mean, we had not bad end results with Carlos, I suppose. Could have been, could have been worse. You're right, uh, Jill, you're good. Let's give you a dose of the good stuff, shall we? Oof. Hey! Are you okay? Yes. Barely. What's going on? No way! That monster just doesn't give up! What? I thought we killed that thing! No. It's been waiting for you! He's playing with us. Carlos, do you think that it's unstoppable? No, I don't think so. I'm sorry, Jill, but I've got to go take care of a few things. Oh, and bad news. Nikolai is still alive. Nikolai? Are you sure? Yes. I don't know how, but I do know that he is our enemy. Remember, don't trust him. I'm pretty sure Jill knows not to trust him. Uh, anyway, we are of sorts at a save room, so I think we're going to save it. Now, um, Nemi's still stomping around out there, isn't he? So, uh, that's going to be a little bit awkward. I think it's time we go put Nemi down again. We're going to drop these things. You know what? Let's take the mine thrower out for a spin, shall we? Uh, we've got plenty of mine rounds. 
Uh, I guess we'll take that just in case. We've got lots of enhanced shells. Although the enhanced shotgun is kind of slow, really. Um, all right, we'll, we'll roll with that. Uh, that should be fine. Right, come on, Nemesis. Let's do this. You've been waiting for me to get up like a gentleman. I think his patience ran out, though. Oh, I guess he ran away. Well, I hope you didn't run too far, mister. I got a, I got a grenade launcher. Well, mine thrower. Let's stick up your ass. Here he is. You're right there, big fella. Whoa, to you too. Oh, he's 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 a little bit feisty today. Bit of a feisty one, sir. Can I get up, please? He's just whipping my ass. Well, let's feed him some of these. It's not the most powerful weapon in the game, but you know. Uh. Yeah, sure. When are we ever going to use this thing? Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, ow, please stop throwing me around. Can you stop whipping my ass, dude? Or at least pay me first, seriously. Do you have any idea how rude that is? I guess he just straight up doesn't care about how rude it is. Whoa. Yeah, this mine launcher thing really ain't up to much at all, is it? Oh, we're empty. Oh, that was awkward. There we go. Uh, I guess... We'll switch up to the good stuff then, shall we? Come on, buddy. Run, Jill. There we go. Yeah. Thought I'd give the mine thrower a go, but in hindsight, that wasn't a very good idea, because all it's really done is got us injured, sadly. When considering this is one of the easiest fights with him, to be honest. Come on, dude. There he goes. There he goes. There he is. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, he's feisty. Whoa, he's feisty. Get down, boy. Come down. No, there's a lot of people that are thirsty for Jill, okay? Get in line, buddy. Uh-oh. That was a bad... That was a bad reload. Oh, I got way too into it then. Jesus. Get up, Jill. Don't let him whip your ass whilst you're down. Come on, Joe. Ow. That hurts. Oh, God. We're on... In Look. This is all the mine throwers' fault. I'm blaming the mine thrower on this. Come on, buddy. Ooh. He's quick. Yeah, he's angry. He's angry. He's hopped up on all kinds of chemicals. Really? He just... Oh, God. What the fuck was that about? There we go. Stars. Yeah, okay, that was probably... That was as bad as that could have possibly gone. Man, why is it when you... Ugh, fucking recording. Anyway, well, that's the last time we actually have to take him down for bonus goodies. Oh, that was so bad. I'm actually very tempted to redo that because that was absolutely abysmal. But, you know, we won't. Alright, fine. We'll leave it. Two first aid kits on that fight. Really? I don't know if I've ever done that bad before. One? Yeah, okay, fine. Two? Ugh. I think he hit me twice when I was practicing. Uh, but saying that, um, I suppose, you know, when you're actually uh, not commentating. I say commentating. Panicking internally, really, is more accurate. Um, right. Also, I had a headache with pictures. We've got these big packs of gunpowder. Or this big pack of gunpowder, which you can't mix with another big pack of gunpowder, I'm pretty sure. Like, you can only mix these singular tubs. You can't mix, like, a triple A and a triple B together. 
I, I, I don't know why. It's silly, but there we go. But that's fine, you know. It, it is what it is at this point. Right, anyway, we need the uh, lockpick. Oh, God. we. Oh, I'm so tempted to do that again. I'm so tempted to do that again. But I won't. Um, okay, let's get out of here. Do I really still have the mine thrower? I do, don't I? That's okay. We'll hold on for it for now. No, I don't. I put that back. Alright, well, let's go. Uh, yeah, so we don't actually have to take Nemi out again. You know, he's pretty much as defeated as he's going to get. Uh, at least for optional battles. So, you know, swings and roundabouts, I suppose. Anyway, to the park. Oh, you know, I can't believe I used two first aid sprays on him. Two! Yeah, the zombies are gone here miraculously, by the way. Two first aid sprays. Oh, God. <sighs> unbelievable, guys. Absolutely unbelievable. Anyway, the dead walk. Because apparently that's what they do. This is another save room anyway. There should be some goodies in here. There's also a key in here that we really need. We've got some mine rounds. There should be something in these. Yeah, more mine throw rounds. Yeah, I shouldn't have used the mine thrower really. It, the thing is, when you ready the mine thrower, it's so slow to bring up and put back down. And it's also a very slow firing weapon. That was a mistake. I shouldn't have done that. I just, to be honest, like I very rarely ever use the mine thrower. Uh, I just wanted to see what it's like. It's, yeah, it, it's, it's, yeah, it's not good, is it? To be honest, it's really not good. But if we were playing, uh, if this was like our third playthrough or something, um, funny enough, wow, we've got so much health. It's like eight first aid sprays. And we, it's not like we've been careful with them. Uh, yeah, if we uh, if we were playing like our second completed playthrough or something, that would actually be an infinite ammo that we can apply to a weapon. But we are not. So uh, let's grab photo E. The zombies are attacking. Yeah, yeah. I guess I guess they are. It's not very nice of them, to be fair. But, I guess. You know, zombies do what zombies do. Um, now. Let's... You know what? Let's just eat this herb. Because where we're going... Oh, things get a little bit tasty. Let's just say that. We're going to the park. No good happens at the park. It is literally hunter territory, which is fun, but yeah, dude, don't even bother. You gonna come get me? Come get me, big boy. Show me what you got. Yeah, you got nothing. What I thought. Now, let's see what we have in here. What have we rolled? Have we rolled hunters? Or have we rolled something else? There we rolled hunters. Cheers, pal. Really? Honestly. Alright, where's the next one? Are we even hitting it? Are we aiming at it? Yeah, sometimes you come in here and there are worms. Uh, obviously, like, the worms are pretty much worthless. He's over there, apparently. Whereabouts? Oh, he's there. Okay. I'm not sure if we can hit him. Oh, we can. Oh, we we must have been hitting him, because he's just about dead. Alright. So, is that just two of them, then? Yeah, looks like it. Just two of them. That's fine. Ah. <sighs> Could have been better, but I guess it is what it is. Right now, which way should we go first? 
Uh, that's to the fountain. Yeah, we don't need to. Oh, we could go to the fountain first. Just because it has herbs. At least I hope it has herbs. Yeah, we're clear. And a map. Not that you really need a map for this area, but we'll take it. Thank you. Now, we have herbs here. We've got blue herbs. We've got green herbs. We've got every type of herb here. Apart from red, but we will get red later. I don't think you can come to the park and not find uh, growing herbs, right? But believe me, we are going to be finding herbs. Ah, the thing is, right, I'm going to mix all these up, but I don't know. Because technically that means, like, when we use a uh, herb mix, we're using three herbs instead of two. So... I think that actually lowers our rank even more. We've got that puzzle to do, which calling it a puzzle is a bit generous, really. But we need to get a key first. Um, let's go for you. Let's take the shotgun for a walk, shall we? A shotgun with enhanced rounds. I think a shotgun is a pretty solid choice to be hunting hunters with. We could... Zombies! Have I ever seen zombies here before? Oh, I don't... I don't think so. But... I mean, sure. Fine. There should be hunter gammas here. At least that's what I generally get. This... I don't want to say a pleasant surprise, because I like fighting the hunters. But I mean, oops, premature. I bet that's never happened to you before. Come on. There we go. Yeah, uh, okay. I mean, I may have had zombies there before. I, I can't remember. I've probably played this game a fair few times over the years. Just because I say, you know, it's my least played Resident Evil of the OG Trilogy. There we go. There's the hunters. Oh, God. Yeah, he was a bit feisty, wasn't he? Oof. Right. So we do have hunters here. This should bring us back up to the good side of caution. Because you better believe I don't think that's all of them. Oh, there you go, son. There you go, son. Yeah, made just for you. All right, I think we're clear. Will you take the park key? We will take the park key. He's also holding something. Written orders to the supervisor. Mission requirements, Bravo 16. One, obtain and secure samples of all the information pertaining to this case. Observe and record combat data for, uh, on the UBCS. 2. Destroy evidence including the medical facility that has the medical treatment data. Check the guinea pig's ability to accomplish the mission. Ouch. Once your mission is complete, evacuate the area. Remember that you must not help anyone who is not a supervisor, nor bring anything back that might be traced to where it belongs. Ooh, he appears to have been shot to death. Yeah. Yeah, that's... Bad. What have you got for me, buddy? You got some magnum rounds? Ooh. Yeah, pretty dark stuff. This is the rear gate of Raccoon Park. It is locked. Yeah. Now, we got a uh, gate key. Or a park key, I should say. But it's not... For that part of the park. Alright. Let's get out of here. Over these twitching. Gooey bodies. Zombies here though. Really? Alright. Any hunters? No? You sure? I'd rather trade the worms. Actually in the main area. For the hunter gammas there. Because it's just more fun. Yeah, that means we're not going to get any hunter gammas, really. Um, 
Do you get them in the dead factory? I don't. I'm not sure. I, I haven't played that far yet. Uh, I, yeah, don't know. But yeah, uh, mm, ah, mm. interesting. Interesting. Right. So a control panel for the fountain. Will you open the lid? All right. Now we need the black gears at the top. The light gears at the bottom. And that is uh, how you don't do it. Right, let's try that again. This time with a little bit less failure. Uh, there we go. That'll work. I think there's two ways you can do that puzzle. I'm not 100% sure. It's not exactly challenging anyway. Now we've drained the water, I mean, you can actually turn this fountain on and stuff as well, if you look at the um, pictures. But we don't really need to do that. Okay. So let's get down here. Now, you don't really want to get here and realize that you, you don't have what you need and have to go back. Because as you can see, there's nothing really here apart from those guys. Now, once you've unleashed those guys, this area will become filled with them. So really, you only want to be doing this run once. Hey, friend. Welcome back to life. Oh, he's a quick one. Oh, oh 30 seconds of fun, that was. Come on. Up you come. There's the red herbs that I was telling you so much about earlier. I mean, there's a lot of zombies that were buried in just a t-shirt and jeans. No suits. I guess suits are expensive. Are they not included uh, in the medical plans here? Maybe not. Dude, you just made me waste a shell. I mean, honestly, who the fuck do you think you are, man? Wasted a precious shotgun shell. Well, let's grab these herbs up anyway. No point leaving them for the roaches, I guess. Probably some damn big roaches by now. Alright, what have we got left? Four shells? Yeah, four shells. That's fine. Uh, should we one in this corner? Uh, maybe he's already spawned. There's one down here. There's two down here. Maybe it's because there's two down here. Aim high. Oof. These head pops will never not be satisfying. They really are amazingly satisfying. You don't need to use this right now. Uh, yeah, you, you, you really do, uh, Jill. Okay. Now that leads us to the lodge. Ooh. Where we have some powder. Let's go powder our nose. Why is there no music here? Pretty sure there should be music here. Right. See, that is how we make uh, gunpowder. C. Right? Which is fine. Uh, I think everybody knows that. But we can't mix um, large powders together, which I never knew. Oh, well, maybe I did. I just forgot, but I never realized that. Um, and it's kind of aggravating. Right, we'll take the iron pipe. Sure. I don't think there's anything else of any note in here. Maybe. Uh, I'm not sure. I don't think there's any other items in there. But at least we got some powder anyway. Now, what do we do with Gunpowder C, you may be asking. Um, well, allow me to show you. I need to sort this inventory out. Uh, that can go back. Yeah, uh, so oh, I can't actually prove it here, but it's really unfortunate. Do we want to make some, some good handgun bullets? Because we can't use that for anything else. Uh, 
Maybe. I'll have a think, I think. Okay. Yeah, I can't believe you can't mix like a double B and a double A together. Or a triple B and a triple A. Uh, you know what I mean? You can't mix the big packs. I, I, uh, I don't know why. That's really like freaking strange to me. But uh, that's, that's the way it is. Uh, anyway, uh, let's go grab the lighter. Unless it's just like this version of the game. But th that doesn't make sense, does it? I don't know. Okay, right, anyway. Let's go grab that. Stick this back in the pot. I was very surprised to find that you can't mix large powders. Very surprised. I guess we'll keep that there for now. We don't really need the freeze rounds yet anyway. But I did experiment with that off camera. And I came away thinking, what? So to make gunpowder C, it just needs to be the small pots. No longer need the slicer, we just got it. Aye. And then we're gonna smash right through to the other side. Lovely. Now let's have a little peekaboo through here. Ooh. What secrets do we have here? We have a key. Ah, the part key, yes. The key that we needed. And uh, we have grenade rounds. Grenade, yeah, grenade rounds are in RE3, as we've, like, the standard ones are just totally and utterly worthless. Okay. Uh, there's also, like, um, ink ribbons here, but we don't want them. So, supervisor's report. Actually, let me check my notes. Is it supposed to be the supervisor's uh, yeah, I think so. Um, the endurance ability of the contaminated guinea pigs is truly incredible. Even when shot in a vital area, they can sometimes survive for several days without taking care of the wound. However, after prolonged exposure to the virus, the guinea pig's intelligence level decreases to that of an insect. Even though reviving the dead seems too disgusting the virus may still be of use if we inject the virus into our pow's and release them they would return to their units and turn and then turns turns wow so many typos in this turns into zombies this plan may work well for us in the future that's pretty dark in certain areas the virus seems to have caused the mutation of animals and plants it may be difficult but it will make a good sample for the bioweapon development. It will make a good sample. Samples, plants and animals, samples, for the bioweapon development. I have heard that there is a giant alligator. Yes, but I've only encountered a giant creature moving underground. I don't even want to imagine what creatures spawned that monster. I encountered Nemesis. If it didn't, if I didn't know about it, I would have been contaminated and would have become one of them by now. If it is still walking around in the city, its mission is not yet over. Stars members must be very tough since they have survived until this point. However, they cannot hold out forever. Oh, but Jill can. And Chris. And Baza. Facts from the HQ. Yeah, that's, yeah, this is fine. It's kind of difficult because the list that I have um, of the order to pick up the files in, the files are slightly named different things on there. I don't know if this is like the Japanese version or what. I, I don't know. They're similar but different. Um, 
Attention! The Raccoon City project has been abandoned. Our political manoeuvring in the state uh, in the Senate to delay their plans are now futile. All supervisors should evacuate immediately. The US Army is going to execute their plan tomorrow morning. The city will be obliterated at daybreak for sure. Oh. That's not good. Anyway, let's get out of here. All supervisors, mission terminated. Return immediately. Repeat. All supervisors, return immediately. Over. Hmm, I wonder what those naughty little sausages are planning. This guy looks like he might actually have something on him, but no. It's kind of crazy how many of their own mercenaries they killed. Like, uh, uh, it's pretty, it's pretty rough. I'm quite impressed you've Ooh. managed to stay alive up until now. And you seem to be doing a pretty good job of looking out for yourself. How about helping out? I have no intention of helping you. Because we're nothing but pawns in all this? In a manner of speaking, you are. Our employers wanted a detailed analysis of the zombie beings which were created through infection by the T-Virus. You're saying that they deliberately sent in a military unit to be butchered by their creations? Not exactly. Although the conditions encountered on this operation were extreme, it was an unexpected outcome that the team would be wiped out. We were only required to collect live data from the subjects. Uh-oh. Uh Another mutant. Uh-oh. Yes. Another mutant. However, we shall deal with that maggot in the next episode. So, thank you very much for watching, guys. And as always, till next time. Mm -hmm.